Everything that you once thought worked for you did work for you. But now things are a little bit different because your hormones have changed and hormones really regulate everything. Lifestyle modification is huge. I'm Dr. Wendy, I'm a physical therapist. I've taken care of women for almost 20 years. And here's the thing, women's health is behind and you're gonna have to be proactive and change everything that you've once done. You're gonna have to change your activity levels. You're gonna have to change your supplements. You're going to have to change your movement pattern. Cortisol is one of the master hormones and it is the one that actually makes a big difference in women. Not to be discrediting your sex hormones, but your cortisol is really huge. So learning how to control your stress, learning how to rest, eating food that nourishes your body and moving your body, then training your brain is really the key to surviving perimenopause. There will be no one pill, there will be no one cream, one thing, it's not gonna be one thing. But if you do this right, if you start to make life changes at midlife, at perimenopause, 35, wherever your changes happen, remember the changes you're doing now can serve you well for the rest of your life. If we do this right, this could be one of your last really hard struggles because you have survived puberty. Maybe you survived birth, childbirth. Maybe you survived a hysterectomy. Maybe you survived cancer. But now you have a big hurdle of managing your hormones and changing your lifestyle to serve you well. But I know you can do it because you have a 100% track record of surviving thus far. Hit the plus sign and follow for more Women's Health and Wellness Tips.